first race of 2019 in the NTT IndyCar Series. It really is hard to decipher the smiles of the drivers, crew members, and fans that are just happy to have the series back at it this year versus the smiles surrounding the return of Robert Wickens. Hard to believe it's been six months now since that horrific accident at Pocono. He suffered a spinal fracture, spinal cord injury, neck fracture, and so many more that certainly limited the use of his lower extremities. He is working ever so hard to get back. The videos he's been posting on social media have been so inspirational. And one of the goals that he's been working towards, get back to the season opener here in St. Pete. Another goal? get back in a race car, and he firmly believes it's going to happen. If not for the IndyCar Series, another one. Yeah, 100%. You know, the, the goal is to get back into an IndyCar. Um, you know, we won't know until <laughs> until I try it to see if it's um, a, a reality. But um, apart from that, I mean, there's been so many remarkable drivers that have succeeded with hand controls in motorsports that it makes me believe that regardless of how my progression goes, I will be in a race car again. Um, just a matter of which car. The dream is an Indy car. I want to finish this journey, you know, not just for myself, but for the whole motorsport community. I, I don't want to, uh, I don't want to fall short in any way. One of the things Robert reports is that his improvement has been steady. He has yet to really plateau, and as long as that continues to happen, hope continues to happen as well. We'll see what happens, but plenty of smiles here this weekend in St. Petersburg. With the IndyCar Series Day First, RTV6 Sports. On the track today, practice on the streets of St. Pete. A solid showing for rookie Colton Herta. The 18-year-old was fourth quickest in the second practice after 17th in the morning. Ryan hunter though, had the very good day. Second early, fastest lap in the afternoon. He looks like he is the favorite to win pole in Saturday's knockout qualifying.